what's going on guys this is bull trainer playing boom beach so yes people have been waiting for this and i'm gonna be taking down dr terry from stage one to stage 20 with tanks and grenadiers guys grenadier Gren grenader <laughs> damn it's really hard to say it anyways let's jump into the base and this is what i'm actually cooking right now four fleets of grenadiers and four fleets of tanks and the question is Am I able to take down Dr. Terror Stage 20 with these troops? So check them out, yo. The Grenadiers are totally awesome. And I'm going to be boosting up my troops. I'm going to be boosting up my troop health. I'm going to be boosting up my troop damage. I'm going to be boosting up my gun, boat, energy. Because it makes my troops badass against Dr. Terror. So, oh man, I'm so excited to take down Dr. Terror with these new troops. I think it's gonna be really awesome to use this kind of troops on the uh, Dr. Tur event. So, oh, this is actually uh, the, the new thing in the update. You actually see the house and it actually zooms out when you see it. So look at that, it zooms out and you get the real player uh, uh, icon from it. So. Never mind, guys. Let's start with Dr. Terror. And this is ter ter Terror Stage 1. And taking out the tanks, taking out the grenade dudes. I'm gonna be saying grenade dudes from now because I'm really struggling with saying grenadier. Oh my dangers of the dangleberry. So, damn, damn, damn of the dangleberry. It's so fun to check out the, uh, the, the troops or the new troops or the grenade dudes just tossing the grenades. It's so cool. It's really, really awesome. It makes me want to just shake shake the booty and goes crazy oh i feel like that guys i feel i want to shake the booty oh so let's take the third stage two so from what i see here where is the problem where's the challenge there's only one sniper tower there i'm guessing like one grenadier will be able to take down the third stage two Oh my dangers, it's so cool. Check them out. How they troll the grenades. They're like they're like pulling that full power, stretching back, and like boom, throwing it. They're just throwing it and it goes ham dang guys. So the terror stage two is done and it actually looks pretty stable from what I see here, because um when I see the, the tanks are a bit in front of the grenadiers, that means the grenadiers, when they're tossing the grenades, they're pretty much not... What should, how should I actually explain this? Um, I think this combination is the best for using the grenadiers because um, the grenadiers are tossing the grenades randomly and the tanks are actually standing far behind so they are not they're not actually hitting the, the tanks. I, I actually tested out the heavy and the grenadiers. It was actually a bit harsh because the heavies are actually going too much near the defensive buildings and the grenadiers is just far behind and they're actually tossing the heavies. So that means heavies and grenadiers is not a good option right now. I think the tanks and grenadiers and all, all grenadiers is a really good combo. Um, on Dr. Terror right now, I'm going to be just sticking with the four fleets of tanks and four fleets of the Grenadiers. So it just took down the Terror Stage 4, guys. Terror Stage 4 just went down. I got the victory. smack a like a like a boom yeah. Taking you down like a mother bro. Like a mother bro, bro. Okay, Terror Stage 5. And I also, I also see that the tanks... Um, it's actually up, uh, updated the uh, the icon of the tanks. I think it's really really awesome. You see the uh, you see actually the tip of the barrel on the tanks are actually a bit outside of the, the the square thing or yeah the square thing and it actually looks like 3D. So, third stage five. I'm just having some fun taking down the HQ five with barrages and this crazy insane troops. Totally awesome. But the challenge is gonna be at tour stage 15, guys. Um, I'm thinking like I'm thinking like if there's a lot of boom cannons, a lot of cannons, it can start. It will be harder. It definitely will be harder because the tanks will be getting one shot and it's gonna be hard. But we're gonna be checking that out later when we get to tour stage 15 and up. Tour stage six, and I'm still having some great time with these troops. Um, I still don't have any casualties um, with warriors when I'm using warriors I'm having casualties in level or stage 10 I think then I start to lose troops but we're gonna be checking out when I'm gonna be starting to lose troops with this combination and 
I want to repeat myself again with the new troop. I love it. I really love it. I know there's a lot of a lot of hate and a lot of positiveness about the new troop, but when you max this grenadiers, they are totally insane. And you totally see this, guys. You totally see this at the grenadiers. They're totally awesome. The level 10. It's so much damage, and you have a lot more health pull or HP on the uh, the grenadiers. That means they can they can handle more damage or yeah damage from the defensive buildings. So. I would actually not recommend to use the Grenadiers at level 1 and up to level 5. But I think from level 5 and 10, they are just massive destruction. Massive destruction. They're like the tanks, actually. Tanks are really, really bad when they're low level. But when you actually climb up on the level on the tanks, they get really, really crazy and really insane. Same as with the Grenadiers. When you get up on the level, they get really bad ass. So, third stage 8 already guys, and I'm having a really, really great time. I'm smiling right now, because it's just so cool to see these uh, troops in action. I really like the, I really like the sounds from the Grenadiers, it's like click, click, boom, click, click, boom. And it's really, oh man, I really can't say it enough, I just love this update. This is what Supercell, or the Boom Beach developers, should have done on the last update, I think, because they are... It's just amazing. It's just amazing. Woo -hoo -hoo. So let's jump over to Terror Stage 9. Oh man. Oh, it's so cool. It's so cool, guys. So cool. Anyways, I also noticed that um, it's really important to take down the rocket launchers and the shock launchers as well when you're using this kind of troops. Because uh, it's really not... What do you call it? How should I actually um, explain this? Using a medic when you're using this kind of troop, I, I don't think it's really good because you will be lacking. You will be lacking of DPS, and with this with this kind of troop, it's like it's about damage, guys. It's about damage. It's about taking down buildings really really fast. And if you have one landing craft with medic or two landing crafts with medics. It's gonna slow up the DPS and the, uh, the the defensive buildings, the machine guns and boom cannons and cannons whatsoever. Targeting your troops will take you down. So I actually recommend go pure offensive when you're using this kind of troops. Um, all grenadiers or grenadiers and tanks. Those are the best combo. Um, I've actually tested out the uh, riflemen and the grenadiers i don't think it's a good thing because they're actually killing the rifleman um i was i was actually taking down npc base i had four fleets of riflemen and four fleets of grenadiers and the rifleman actually just went straight forward while the grenadiers was tossing the grenades and pretty much blasted my rifleman i was like whoa what's going on i cannot use this troop so what i found out it's actually tank and grenadiers or all grenadiers. That's the massive comp. That's the best combination for this new troop. So we're actually in terror stage ten right now. Haven't lost any troops yet, and it seems really, really solid from my eyes now. From my, from what I see now, this troop can be the new super troop on Boom Beach. Totally badass. I haven't tested it out on real player basis yet, uh, the, the tanks and the grenadiers, but I'm gonna be testing that out later. Uh, on this video, I'm going to be doing Dr. Terror. So, Terror Stage 11, guys. Okay, we got like... We got like... Three rocket launchers up in the north there. Yeah? And I'm going to be taking down the... Uh, taking out the troops. No, I'm, gonna, I'm not going to be talking like that, guys. I'm not going to be talking British because I basically cannot talk British. It's really hard. I love the language, but it's really hard. I really want to learn it. Okay, the grenaders are actually in action right now. They're tossing the grenades all over the place. And it's actually taking care of the boom mines as well. So you do, basically, you, you do not need to take care of the boom mines. You don't need to use your artillery shells to take care of the boom mines. But I did it right now because I just wanted to have some fun. Okay. Wow. Ooh, hoo, hoo. I'm having so much fun, guys. So much fun. I'm just... Cruising my way up on terror stages with this new troop. Oh man, totally cool. Terror stage 11 went down and without a casualty. What is going on, guys? What is going on? And I'm really hoping you guys are just enjoying this right now. 
I haven't checked out. I haven't checked out the other YouTubers right now on uh, if there's any grenaders uh, that have cleared the terror stages from one to twenty. I think I'm gonna be the first one uh, reaching to uh, to terror stage twenty with this kind of troops. So, okay, working on the shock launcher behind there, and there we go. Got it. I think I also noticed that shock launcher is a major threat. Or, or did I say that? Or did I think I said that? Yeah. Anyways, rocket launcher and shock launcher are deadly against against this uh, against this uh, new troop. Okay, we're on terror stage twelve. Smacking the machine gun there and smacking the uh, I'm gonna be smacking that rocket launcher. I really hope I take down the rocket launcher. Yes. The cool thing with this new troop. You do not actually expect that the building went, will go down far behind there and suddenly it goes boom, boom, it's gone. It's like, what What happened right now? It was just massive explosion, boom. Things are just flying away, things are just pumping and blasting and a lot of things are just... Yes, explosion guys, explosion, yes. Oh my dangles of the dangleberry guys. This is so much fun. This is so much fun. Okay. What do we have here? We have cannon and boom cannon right there. Um, that will be really deadly against uh, against the tanks. The tanks can actually handle one shot from the cannon, the boom cannon, uh, at the terror stage 13 and up. It's really, really dangerous. So keep a close eye when you're using tanks because uh, tanks are actually really, really critical. When, when it's meeting a boom cannon or cannon. Okay. So the major threat here is the boom cannon right now. And the cannons. And I'm taking out the threats. The machine guns and the mortars or the sniper tower aren't actually a threat to this kind of troops. Because the tanks can absorb so much damage against sniper towers, against machine guns, against mortars, against flamethrowers. Yes, they are just totally Terminator guys. Totally Blastoise of the Terminator. Okay, I think I'm gonna be losing some troops now because it's really it's getting it's getting harder now. I, I definitely feel it's getting harder now. Okay, we have we have the machine gun at the left side there. It's not a threat. The only threat I see now is actually the boom cannon. One rocket launcher cannot hurt my team. Well, if it if if it fires on my grenadiers, it's gonna be a problem. But it's gonna fire the tanks. So look at the line, guys. The uh, grenadiers are actually a bit behind of the tanks, and that's a perfect range for this kind of combo. This kind of combo. Yes. Oh my dangle, guys. Whew. Ah. Oh. Okay, let's jump over to terror stage 14 here. What do we have here? Okay, it's definitely getting more insane now. Uh, a lot of a lot of cannons. All over the place. I haven't lost anything yet, I think. Taking out the boom cannon right there in the front of the beach. We have two cannons behind there and one boom cannon. I'm gonna be sorting out that boom cannon. Wow, yikes. There's two cannons on the right side there. Mm. What are you gonna do here? Okay. I'm gonna be taking out the northern um, the cannons and the boom cannons probably. I only have 41 gunboat energy left. I need to take out the tanks. I also need to take out all of my troops right now. Shocking the shock launcher, but the shock launcher shocked me first. God damn it, brah. God damn it, brah. La brah. <laughs> what am I saying? I'm just enjoying this, guys. I'm just enjoying this so much. So much. Just love these troops. Tossing the grenades all over the place. Destruction is actually, I would say that these troops are total destruction, total destruction. But the funny thing is, if there's only a uh, uh, HQ left and you have one grenadier attacking the HQ, it takes forever because the, the grenadier can, it misses so much. It's just tossing wildly, guys. Tossing here, tossing there, tossing here, tossing there, and it all, it, it misses so much, guys. It misses so much. So that's the uh, the negative thing about the grenade is that it's so random. They're so random. It's not unpredictable, or it's not predictable. <laughs> God dang it, yo! Whoa, whoa, a crystal there, guys. A crystal. 
Totally awesome. We're getting close to turn stage 20 now. We're actually on turn stage 15. Hmm. Okay, this seems to be really easy base. Uh, rock launcher on the right side. We have a cannon to start there. Shock launcher. Okay, this is going to be an easy stage, I think. I'm going to be taking out the cannons first. And there we go. Wow. It got a lot of HP right now. Let's see how much damage it can take. Okay, that's the last artillery shell. Mm, 58 gunboat energy left. It's really sketchy. 31. Okay, I'm going to be taking out my troops right now. I'm going to be shocking that cannon instead. I think that's the wisest idea, taking out the troops and shocking the cannon. Okay, there we go. Shocking the cannon. Taking the cannon really fast down with the, the uh, grenadiers and the tanks all together. Boom! It went down. So where's the last threat? Okay, we have, the, we have a cannon on the right side there. <clears throat> wow, I'm, my, my throat is actually dry right now. I'm losing my voice, guys. I'm losing my voice very soon. Mm, 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 mm. Fishy guacamole, guys. Fishy guacamole. I definitely need fishy guacamole because I need some power pop right now. I need fishy guacamole to pump up myself. But I'm going to be finishing this video before I eat the fishy guacamole. Okay, we're just having some fun. We have the tanks and the grenadiers spread it out really good here. So massive damage. It's so massive. It's so cool to see this. Ah, oh, it's really awesome. And the reason why I'm using tanks and grenadiers as well, there's been a lot of comments on my videos. Can you use grenadiers and tanks? Of course, that is why I'm making videos as well. I want to listen to my comments and subscribers out there and viewers out there. What do you want to see? If you, I'm always, I'm always checking out my comments, guys. I'm always checking out my comments. Um, if there's anyone asking, like, okay, could you do like uh, six fleets of medics and one, or yeah, six fleets of medics and two fleets of uh, tanks? Of course, I would do it, guys. I would do it. That's why I'm making video. I'm really hoping you guys are just enjoying the entertainment I'm doing for you guys. I'm just hoping that you guys are just, yes, appreciate it. And I definitely see positive feedback. And I just want to say thank you guys. I wouldn't be, I wouldn't be here right now without you guys. I wouldn't be here to show you the high level gameplay. And I just want to say thanks. So much thank you to you guys. So much thanks. <laughs> okay, but I'm gonna be stopping with a thank you because uh, I'm really bad at this, guys. I'm really bad at this. But I want you guys to know that I really mean it from the, from the bottom of my heart, yo. I really mean it. I appreciate. It. I I appreciate it. So leave a comment on any kind of videos what you want to see. I'm gonna be trying to do as best as I can to fulfill the wishes out there. Okay, turret stage 16, and wow, I need to take on the rocket launcher, there we go, we got the rocket launcher, and the shock, okay, I really hate shock launchers, I really hate it, it basically freezes your troop, and you basically cannot do anything, because when you actually bulk up your team, when you're using a troop combo like this, you basically bunch it up, and when there's a shock launcher there, Tossing that god dangleberry of the shock on the troop It freezes and I cannot do nothing. I cannot do anything yo <laughs> Oh, I feel so crazy sometimes or maybe I'm crazy. I don't really know guys. I don't really know but Yes back to this third stage 16 just cruising and smashing everything I see here actually only a cannon or rocket launcher up on the right side of the headquarters up there. That's the only threat left, guys. Only threat left. And, whoa, tossing another shock. I really hope I can take down the cannon right now. And same with the rocket launcher. Come on, take down the rocket launcher. Yes, it should be going down. Booyah, yes. I took it down before it, sh uh, before it actually fired on me. Yes. Yes, another crystal, guys. Two crystals. What's going on? And I haven't been checking out the uh, the stage 19 thingy because this is the first Doctor Tur event after the update, and it was actually guaranteed a crystal on Tur stage 19. So we're gonna be checking that out if we're gonna be getting that crystal. 
So right now I have gotten like two crystals and I'm I'm gonna be getting one crystal from the stage 19 and two crystals from the last stage. So there's gonna be a lot of crystals on this Dr. Terror. And I love crystals because you can make your crystals to power powder. And you basically need power powders to boost up your troops, uh, boost up your building health, boost up your building defensive damage thingy. <laughs> defensive thingy. What am I talking about, yo? Third stage 17, guys. Okay, what is the major threat here? Uh, flamethrower at the start, machine gun at the start. I don't think it's going to be that hard. I can just toss a medic there or a med kit to overheal the flamethrower and machine gun's damage. Um, come on, do more damage. Pump the damage, guys. Pump the damage. There's a lot of grenadiers. Come on. Okay, there's a lot of cannons right now. North side, guys. North side, there's a lot of cannons. I need to take him down. I think I will be taking them down because I have a lot of shocks. And I'm going to be shocking this this cannons and rock launcher 100% guys. Okay, we're starting to take down the, the cannons. And I'm going to be shocking the shock launcher behind there now. There we go. Awesome like a possum guys. Awesome like a possum. Oh man. When you guys got enough gold to up your troops. Upgrade the Grenadiers because they're just so fun to play guys. I can guarantee your Boom Beach experience will just increase 100% because my Boom Beach experience is increased 55,000% up to the sky guys when I tested out the troops. My eyes was like, whoa, totally awesome like a fish. That was the first thing I had in my mind, fish. Fish guys. And when I'm thinking fish, it is so awesome. It's just too awesome. So terror stage 17 just went down on me guys. Terror stage 17 went down. And I basically lost one tank there and one grenadier. Okay. Instant finishing the grenadier. Terror stage 18 right now. And what about this base? Cannons. Boom cannons. Uh, shock launcher. No, there's no shock launchers here. That's cool. Only, only two rock launchers. Okay, there's only two rocket launchers here. I'm gonna be taking you down, bro. I'm gonna be taking you down. I'm gonna be you gonna be, you're gonna be tasting my fish, man. You're gonna be tasting my fish, guacamole. You're gonna pump down your cannons. There we go. So this is the third stage 18, and it really looks like we're gonna be taking down the third stage 20, guys. The third stage 20, it's gonna go down on me, guys. It's gonna feel so good. Yes. So Let's take out the troop. I have like 43 gunboat energy left. I need to take out my troops. Okay. Take out the troops. I need to shock the boom cannon behind there. Same with the cannon. There we go. This is a perfect start, guys. It's a perfect start. Bunched up my grenadiers and tanks. They're just tossing massive grenades all over the place while the tanks are hitting with the big guns. Taking out everything, yo. Taking out everything. And the threat is just actually going going away i'm taking them all out taking them all out i have a lot of gunboat ng i'm having no problem on problem on shocking those cannons and whoa i got shot by the boom cannon but i survived it ah oh, that's because i boosted up my tanks the building health no the troop health if i didn't boost up my health troop health there my tanks would be gone my tanks would be gone like a like a stone in the skies, guys. Like the stone falling from the skies. Yes. <laughs> Working the third stage shading right now. It does looks like it's going down. There's no other else defensive buildings hitting my troops. It's going down. Boom! Booya of the bra, guys. Booya of the bra. Yes. Third stage shading went down. Yes. <laughs> I lost only two grenadiers there guys only two that's awesome guys I actually think that these troops are more efficient to use rather than warriors because I'm losing a lot more warriors and far more diamonds when I'm using the warriors uh, right now I haven't been losing more than 50 diamonds and in instant finishing the troops or maybe, maybe less I really cannot remember but I think it's like 40 to 50 diamonds only and when I'm using the warriors it's, we're talking about like 100 to 200 or 300 diamonds to uh, Instant finish the warriors and I'm completing third stage 1 from third stage 20 so 
I think this is a really, really awesome Dr. Terror Troop. Definitely a go winner. Yes, a winner. <laughs> go winner. What is that, yo? Okay, Terror Stage 19. We're getting super close to Terror Stage 20 right now. Um, we're gonna be shocking. I'm gonna be shocking the boom cannon, the cannon right in the start of the beach there. And wow, I'm taking so much damage from the machine gun there. The uh, the grenadier is actually suffering so much damage right now. Wow, I have lost a lot of grenadiers already. One, two, three, four, five, six grenadiers already. What's going on? I need to take down this base. I need to pump up more base here. Pump up more. I need to pump the base. <laughs> pump up the base. Yeah, I feel so crazy going, going crazy. Dang us. Yes. I have no more words, guys. I have no more words, and my throat is really dry. I just need to take down the terror stage twin right now. I need to take it down before I go really crazy banana. Banana sugar. Sugar leaf. Yes. Okay. Working on the terror stage 19 right now. Having some great fun. And the grenadiers are just working. Okay. I think I might lose this terror stage. Oh. I have like four grenadiers and really few tanks left. Oh, uh, will I be able to take down this base? That's the big question right now. That's the big winning question. And is the general able to take down the terror stage 19 with this troop combination? Or do I need to change my, my troops to warriors? We're going to be finding that out right now. Taking out the rocket launcher. We have we still have the sniper towers there. Oh, man. Tossing medkits upon the troops right now. Okay, working on some of the... Okay, I, there's actually two rocket launchers hitting my troops here. And there's actually three sniper towers. Wow. I need to fulfill. I need to do this, guys. I need to complete this. Still have a lot of... I still have some grenadiers. This is a maxed up grenadiers. Come on, bros. Throw more grenades. You need to hit the headquarters and not the grass, yo. Not the grass or the leaf. You need to hit the headquarters. The headquarters is burning now. Still have three tanks left. Soaking the damage from the rocket launch. Come on, Grenadiers. More damage, more damage. We definitely need more damage. Come on, yo. Come on, come on, come on. Take down the turret stage 19. Okay. I think we're going to be taking down this base, guys. If the tank survives the rocket launcher damage, I will be taking down this base. Definitely, guys. Definitely going to be taking down this HQ. Come on, okay, 5% left on the HQ. Come on, come on, hit the HQ. Okay, it looks very good, guys. Come on, come on. Nah, man, come on. Yes, yes, one more toss, one more toss. I cannot survive more rock. Yes, I took it down. Terror stage 90 went down with this troop, guys. Went down with this troop. So this is the final moment. And there we go, we got the crystal there, guys. We got the crystal, guaranteed crystal in the terror stage 19. So it's time to cruise over to Terror Stage 20. It's the final moment of truth. Will the general be able to take down Terror Stage 20 with grenadiers and tanks? We're gonna be checking that out right now. So what's the big threat here? Okay, we got like four rocket launchers. We got several cannons. I think it's gonna be actually... I think we're gonna be doing this, guys. I think this is gonna be totally doable. Okay, taking out the rocket launcher in front. Okay, we have four rocket launcher behind there. And we have a weak rocket launcher on the right side there. There's no boom cannon. There's only cams actually. A lot of machine. This is going to be a win, guys. I see it now from the uh, from the sky. I see this is going to be a win. Okay, taking out the troops. It's the final moment, guys. Terror stage 20. I'm using tank combination. I'm using the tank and grenadier combination. This is four fleets of tanks, four fleets of grenadiers. They're boosted up, and this total chaos, guys. Total chaos. So check this out: tossing a medkit upon the tanks and the grenadiers, doing some massive damage against everything. The grenadier sees is tossing the grenades everywhere, tossing the grenades everywhere. I'm gonna be shocking that cannons over there. Yes, this is gonna be a win, guys. This is gonna be a takedown Terror Stage 20. I think I'm gonna be the first YouTuber out there actually taking down Dr. Terror Stage 20. Wow.